All right, this morning I am going to cook me a breakfast burrito because I have the taste for burritos, so I'm going to do it vegan style. I'm going to start with some tofu and I'm going to just drain the water and crumble it up in the pan like I did with my other egg video. And I'll show you what else I'm going to add. And I'm going to use these. This is something I found, almond flour wraps. Um, of course, there's less carbs in it. Um, and you can get two of them for uh, 190 calories. All right, so I'm going to also put two sausage patties, vegan sausage, sausage patties in the pan as well because I'm going to actually grind them up and put them inside of the tofu egg. And I used, this is one of the best brands I found, Beyond Breakfast Sausage. All right, I also used a pat of Country Crot, um, plant-based butter with olive oil. All right, this sausage fries just like regular sausage. It's just not meat, and it smells just like sausage. All right, as you can see, I took the sausage out. So now what I'm getting ready to do, so that the tofu has a sausage taste, I'm going to go ahead and move the tofu over into the sausage juice and mix it together and start adding my seasoning. All right, I'm going to show you all the seasonings that I'm going to put in it. I love, love, love nutritional yeast. It has kind of like a cheesy flavor. So I'm going to put, uh, I'm not really sure how much. I just dump it in there until I feel satisfied. All right, so enough nutritional yeast. Turmeric for color. Roasted garlic. Onion powder. Mrs. Dash table blend. I don't use salt, so no salt. Another Mrs. Dash favorite is the chicken flavor. And I found this at Whole's Food. This is amazing. Bacon flavored seasoning. Okay, I've added all my seasoning, so now I'm getting ready to add my cheese. All right, this is the best cheese that I have found that's vegan, and it melts really, really well. So I'm going to put enough in there until I'm satisfied, however much you want. All right, I cut up some onions that I'm getting ready to put in the pan so they can get soft. I cut up my sausage, and I also have some spinach mixed with some other type of greens. Okay, my onions have cooked down some, so now I'm getting ready to add the sausage. I added the spinach, and now I'm getting ready to heat my wrap. You're going to heat it on medium heat for about 15 seconds on one side, then flip it and heat the other side. All right, put your little cream cheese on the wrap after you take it out of the pan and make sure you don't overcook it. It needs to just be about 10 to 15 seconds on each side. That's it. All right. Kite Hill is the cream cheese that I used. It is really, really good. And this is what the breakfast wrap looks like. It's really, really good. Those of you who just have to have something a little sweet with your breakfast, uh, my daughter likes to uh, squirt a little bit of agave on top of hers. So that's another option. And also sometimes I add mushrooms. So if you want to add mushrooms, you can add mushrooms. Whatever it is you normally add to an omelet, that is what you would add to the um, mixture. So I hope you enjoy. And there you have it.